Hey everybody, how you doing? Uncle Vinny here. You know what's coming up? That's right, health chat. Grab a cup of coffee, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Everybody, I'm Dr. Nick Circle. I am so excited to be here with you. Welcome to a new season of Health Chat. Today, I have an exciting topic to delve into. We'll be discussing functional medicine. But before we get started, Remember to hit that notification button, subscribe to our channel so that you can get all the new videos that are coming out from us this year. In our relentless quest for health and well-being, a transformational approach reshapes our understanding of medicine. Welcome to the world of functional medicine, where every aspect of our health is interconnected. That's important to remember as we go through today's show. Functional medicine is patient-centered healthcare that aims to identify and address root causes of disease, giving it a holistic approach. Consider all the factors. Influencing health, including mind, body, and spirit, and community is essential. Scientific and evidence-based utilizing latest research finding the guide to treatment plans focusing on interactions between genetics, environment, and lifestyle factors. And not merely as the absence of disease, but a state of immense vitality. That's what we want. We want to feel vital as we get older. We want to feel vital right now. The patient empowerment is really important. Engaging patients in their healing process, empowering them through education and collaboration in care decision-making. That's the difference. You're taking control. We're just being a coach or I'm just being a coach. In contrast, conventional medicine versus functional medicine seeks to promote wellness by understanding the fundamental biological processes, environmental inputs, and genetic predispositions that influences health and disease, offering a more comprehensive approach of understanding the genetics, the environment, and the lifestyle factors. Conventional medicine primarily focuses on symptom management, treating immediate health issues as they arise, often through standard protocols and medications. This approach excels in acute care, such as treating infection, broken bones, and emergency, where immediate symptom relief is paramount. So there is a need. We're not saying that there's not a need for everyday medicine. We're just saying that there's another option for chronic conditions. Functional medicine, on the other hand, delves into the root causes, it seeks to identify and address underlying causes of health issues rather than just alleviating the symptoms. A detailed understanding of the patient's genetics, biochemical, lifestyle factors is essential to developing a personalized treatment plan that can include changes in your diet, your lifestyle, stress management, detoxification process, along with conventional treatments when necessary. The critical difference lies in the approach. Conventional medicine often asks the question, what is the problem? Then it's matched with the treatment, while functional medicine asks why. The problem exists and aims to treat the cause and the symptoms leading to more sustainable health outcomes. The path of functional medicine is paved with principles of bio-individuality. A patient-centered care, it rejects the notion of passive patient receiving standard treatment and sees patients as active participants in their health care. This is a new concept for most people. We're not used to participating in our own health care. This partnership involves and empowers individuals, giving them the tools, knowledge to make informed decisions about their health. It's about enabling people to become the architects of their well-being, guiding them through lifestyle changes that addresses symptoms and prevents illness. The functional medicine approach is inherently optimistic. I'm an optimistic guy. That's why I love doing functional medicine. We focus on what makes us healthier rather than sick. This is a positive outlook. It fosters a proactive attitude towards health, emphasizing potential for vitality and wellness. It's an approach that understands the, the power of targeted intervention to support this process. From nutritional therapy and exercise to stress reduction, functional medicine integrates evidence-based strategies tailored to individuals' needs 
and goals. The journey towards optimum health is sometimes linear. It involves exploration, experimentation, and sometimes challenges. However, oh man, however, it's a journey of growth, self-discovery, and transformation. Patients learn about their bodies, uncovering how their choices impact their health, how your choices impact your health. That is important to remember. The journey is deeply personal, yet it's supported by the practitioner, me, the coach, and fellow travelers, all dedicated to pursuing health and well-being. Functional medicine impacts and extends beyond the individual. It's a moment that challenges the healthcare status quo, advocating for a system that values prevention. We don't value prevention. We take a pill for every single ailment that we have. Sustainability and a holistic well being is called to view as a health resource for living, not just the absence of disease. This approach can transform lives by alleviating suffering and enhancing the quality of life, allowing us to thrive in the essence. Functional medicine is a testament to resilience of the human spirit and the body's remarkable capacity for renewal. It's a journey towards optimal health, recognizing that each step is closer to vitality, joy, and fulfillment. It's a journey worth embarking on that honors complexity, diversity, and the beauty of human life. If you found this informative, please give us a thumbs up, share it with others. Remember, subscribe and hit that notification button to see our future content. If you have any questions or you want to share your thoughts, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for tuning in. We love you. Be safe and we'll see you soon.